look like you want to get out. You should too, baby. You should too. Oh, I tell you what, guys. I've come to conclusion. No matter how hard I try, I will never get that early morning start. I just guess some people are just way more organized. Are you ready to go, Opie? Yeah? Okay, then we best get trucking. Well, I guess we could probably just get started with our agenda for the day. Today's agenda, we're gonna run from home to Greenfield, Indiana. Think of Greenfield, Indiana. We're gonna start to head for Louisville, Kentucky. Probably not gonna make her all the way down there, but that's what we're gonna do. For those of you that are wondering how Little Bud's first game went on football, well, it didn't go. It didn't happen. They ended up postponing it because uh, where they were going to have it got about six inches of rain and the field was just a solid mud hole. It wasn't mud at the time, but they didn't want to play football on it because they are afraid it'd rip it up pretty good. So it's postponed and we now have a new date to make it home by, which I think we'll be okay making it home by that date. As for Mr. Opie back there, he decided he wanted to go trucking again. And I got it worked out at home with Tater Tot to uh, take care of Jax for me. For he's not home alone all day. If you guys are all wondering what I'm talking about, I guess I should probably lead by, this is a daily vlog. And uh, this is just what's happening on going on in my life right now. So now let's go drive a truck. And I'll be back with you in a little bit. Wait, I forgot to tell you. You're going to love this road. It's a really pretty road. Now we can go drive a truck. Never mind, it's closed. We have to go around it.
look like you want to get out. You should too, baby. You should too. Yeah. What do you think? You see all that grass you want to go run around in for a couple minutes? Yeah. Alright. Let's jump out for a couple minutes. Alright? Come on, big boy. Let's get out and hit grass. Well, guys, trip's going really good, as usual. We've been buzzing across Iowa on Interstate 80 here, and I tell you what, there isn't, uh, there isn't any construction on it. Minor, cons minor, minor, I take that back, minor construction. You guys just gotta watch him. I mean, there's, there's a million different smells out here. Come on, Opie. Come on. Come on. Let's go. You got this whole entire grass area to run. Opie, come on. Get away from the curb. There we go. One minor hiccup, guys. I forgot his toy. I brought him for everything else, but I forgot his toy. You know, let me know when you're doing that. I don't really want to put that on camera. Helps next time. He's not looking so sad this time, guys. He does look a little... How much did you drink, man? Come on. Warning. Hey, Dad. Come on. I'm, I'm going to lift my leg. Getting it all out of your system. That's why you were giving me that weird look. You were looking at me like, Hey, Dad, we got to stop. We need to stop. We need to stop now. That or... Uh, that or he's seen the giant arches. He knows when we see the arches again. Really? I, I'm trying to just pan over to you. Qu quit peeing on your leg, man. You gotta get back in my truck. <sighs> he knows every time he sees the arches, he's gonna get a cheeseburger. Our image, <laughs> really? <laughs> guys, I give up. I, I, I can't, you guys can't watch Opie. Because all he's doing is peeing, repeatedly. He had to pee a lot, a lot. You know, our last trip out last week, we were running pretty good, zipping pretty good. And I was thinking if Opie was with me, there was no way that was going to work out because there wasn't a whole lot of stopping on that trip. Unfortunately, that kind of stunk, you know. We busted our butt to run that trip fast. When we get home, then they called the game. And they said it was too wet to have the game. That's okay. They're going to make it up. At the end of this week, they're going to make it up, which... If I do my scheduling right, by the end of this week, we'll be home without hurrying. But the good part about having Opie here, I, I still can't film him. Now now he's sitting here sniffing other dogs' poop. You're a strange one. Oh, you really are. But uh, <laughs> the good part about having him with me is he gets me out of the truck. He gets me out of the truck, gets me walking. And it feels good to get out of the truck and walk around. They're not long stops. This stop is going to take us about 10, maybe 15 minutes. But it gets me out of the truck more. Opie, come here. I was not done talking to you, young man. Opie, come here. Come here. Look at him. No, oh, Dad, I don't want to come to you. You're going to tell me that I have to listen better. Yes, I know there's 5 million smells out here. You don't need to smell them all. No, there'll be more at the next stop, I promise. And I'm really sorry, I forgot your toy. We could have been playing fetch right here. Maybe we can just wrap a bunch of tape around a plastic bottle. Oh no, Ooh, what do you see? Yeah, there's nothing over there. Nah, we're stopping a truck stop and grab a toy for you. Yeah. Ready to get back in the truck? There's literally nothing over there. What do you keep looking at? Now, before any of you freak out and say, why don't you have him on a leash? Hope he's a very well-trained pup. When he was younger, he, he might have ran off without me telling him what to do. But uh, now, he's trained pretty good. He'll bite whoever I tell him to bite. He won't bite whoever I tell him not to bite. It's about like Jax. He come in my house without... Uh, me there or 
without one of the people in my lovely homestead inviting you, it's going to hurt. So, he's a well-trained pup. He does really good with me. Let's go get him a cheeseburger. I might grab one too. Never mind. Let's walk back to the truck and get the mask. <sighs> Getting old real quick. You think I'd remember it by now? Let's try this again. All right, that time was a success. You can't pass up a McDonald's shake. It's okay if you look at it. I promise. <laughs> yes, you get one. You can look at it. It's okay. Oh, I know. You want one? Okay. You don't blow on your dog's food before you give it to him? Usually I don't either. I seen my dad do it for the first time with his little princess Millie. He blew on the food before he gave it to him. I looked at him and I said, Dad, you didn't blow on food before you gave it to me as a child. He doesn't care. He doesn't want to hear that. He wants to eat. Well, come on up here. Come on. One piece. One piece. Whoa, whoa. There you go. You need to wait till we get on the road though to get some more. I'm not going to sit here and blow on them all for you. Okay? Okay? I promise I'll give you more. Yes, I will. guys we made it here oh no never mind we didn't make it here yet we just had to stop for a potty break I'm just not gonna film him at first this time or maybe for the first 20 minutes because that's all he does is just walk around and pee on everything as you seen we stopped and got first last washed up had him do the trailer too because they were looking pretty bad are you done peeing because I know they want to look at you before they look at me I think he's doing good so far, right Opie? 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 Hi. Oh no. There's a lot of dew on this grass already, isn't there? We're going to have to dry your feet before you get back in the truck, aren't we? <laughs> you still don't like this camera. That's okay. Good boy. Good boy. Yes, good boy. Yeah, you a good boy, aren't you? Yeah. What do you say we go for a little walk? Want to do that? Okay, you're going to start the walk without me? All right, I'll catch up later, man. You be good. Okay, here I come. 
What do you think? You ready to go? You want to get back on the road? We went for a walk. Oh, geez. Got pan away from that one, definitely. Man, that dog is just all kinds of full of fluids and all that other stuff. <laughs> oh, first class, first class. Guys, we have a lot of work to do to her before snow flies. And I know a lot of you have been commenting on it, why I don't have um, quarter fenders on her yet, why I do not have, come on, why I do not have uh, working lights all the way around, those bumper lights right there, why they aren't working. Those are all plans we're, we're going to get to before snow flies. I, I swear to it. Come here, Opie. At least the rim stayed shiny on this side. No, I have not polished the other side. I'm thinking this weekend we might actually call it a truck weekend and just work on first class. We'll see, though. Come here, Opie. Yeah, come here. Come here. Can I go back to trucking now? Yeah? Okay, let's go back to trucking. Let's go. Ooh, that's always a good angle of this truck. Right there. Isn't that a good angle? It's dark out, so the paint looks really good. Come on. That's why I always wash them at nighttime, usually. Then I can't see if anybody goofed up or if the paint, all the flaws in the paint. <laughs> that's all right. Maybe we're cleaner up good this weekend work on the paint a little bit I know I can make that paint look a little better it, it's not ready to be repainted yet and before you say guys and before you say hey Schmidt just repaint the truck no I'm sorry repainting the truck is the absolute last thing I do when I'm working on a truck you know when, I, when everything else is done everything else and you're looking at your truck thinking what does it need done next that's when the truck gets repainted not until then so we have a couple more years before the truck gets painted. Well, anywho, guys, we've got less than 200 miles. Yeah. I think we have less than 200 miles to go till we get to Greenfield, Indiana. Not 100% sure on my math, though, so don't check it. If you know where this rest area is at, don't, don't, don't check my math. I could be way off. We haven't really even been watching it at all. I just know we're in Illinois, if that matters. All right, guys, let's go back to driving. gentlemen we have arrived in Greenfield Indiana we have dropped our trailer and we are hooked on to an empty trailer we'll talk more about our reload tomorrow morning other than that Mr. Opie back there and me we're kind of tired so this is where we're gonna call home tonight you guys be safe and as always we will see you next time as in me and him yeah go to bed I'll talk to you guys later Really? I, I'm trying to just pan over to you. Qu quit peeing on your leg, man. You gotta get back in my truck. <laughs>